hi guys yeah, welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is query tv we do all things makeup and lifestyle so today we are going to be creating brows that are lasting okay we started by cleansing the face and the eye area with micellar water that's where you work with a very clean canvas so this is one of my secret weapons this is the sweat block by classic it's called sweat guard okay this keeps sweat off your face for a very long time and this is my primer it's a matte primer it's a very strong primer together with the sweat block it is it gives a very 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 dry base okay so i'm going to go in now with my hair wax by v05 i'm going to use it to keep my hairs in place okay this will give me a space to work with so you can also do this with normal soap the ladder from soap you can use it okay. and uh, I'm going to use the tail end of my mascara wand and press in the wax into the hair okay it's already giving me the shape and the space where I can draw through so until you're done with this this is a very crucial point though because if you skip this you might have to struggle with the whole thing so i'm placing my setting powder on the hair wax right now on my eyebrows this will help reduce the shining on the hair wax uh, remove it entirely if possible so when i'm done i leave it to set for a while before i brush it off so now I'm going to be using my Davis eye pencil. I'm going to be drawing my lines. Now if you're using a hair wax and you do not put setting powder, you might have difficulty drawing a, a very clean line because your canvas is oily. Okay, so you see how easy it was for me to make these two lines but then you have to use a very sharp pencil for this to happen you can actually do your eyebrows yourself with a, a little practice and do that so i'm going to be making hair like strokes on those brows now this is a uh, optional if you want to be using your spoolie to comb in the strokes optional but if you don't want to scatter the alignment of your hair you can leave it like that I'm using I'm using the adventure concealer cream concealer to highlight my brows now uh, this concealer is very creamy and it's matte okay if you're intending to have eyebrows that last throughout the day and you don't want them shifting at all this concealer is your best bet uh, it's by the adventure okay and uh, while you're using it i advise that you do not let it to sit for a long time you should blend it out immediately if not it gets so tacky that it's very difficult to blend except you add maybe a non matte concealer on it I'm going to be using my blending brush to blend it out immediately okay you can see that even after it took a little time to blend it out it's not uh, easy to come off <laughs> it's a hard one this one but it serves me okay, when I have uh, a client that wants their, day, their makeup to last throughout the day I use it because it goes a long way the foundation i'm using is from classic i'm going to be using foundation in the inner corner the front part of my eye my brows okay 
you measure your bruise to your lower lid that is how you see where your bruise are supposed to stop like angle 45 to your lower lid thank you for watching see you next time make sure you subscribe bye